everyone, it's Bex from Bexley Creations here and I have an unpackaging to do today. Um, I got this big parcel here today from New Frog. So these should all be special German paintings. Um, so, sorry, it's just taking a mouthful of drink there so I don't lose my voice. Um, let's get into it and see what we've got. I love how they come packaged like this. It's almost like a mystery unbagging. Okay. Aha. Okay. So this one is the... Let me find my piece of paper here. Do, 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 do. So it's what I'm calling the ornate butterfly. I have seen this one completed. I can't remember whose channel it was, but I did see it completed and it's absolutely beautiful. Um, this is supposed to be a 30 by 40 centimeter partial special gems and it cost me $7.47. That is such a pretty picture, even just on its own. Now, it's very creased from being folded up, but what I do um, with these paintings is I place them in my painting stash box um, underneath all my other paintings, and the weight of those helps to flatten them down. Um, so that when I go to do them, they're, they're fairly flat. I've never had to iron a painting so far. Okay, so uh, it says there's 16 different gems. It's quite pretty. Our toolkit that came with it, it's just a standard one, single place, a green boat, some wax. Um, the plastic tweezers, I've noticed they tend to send them with their special gem paintings now because sometimes the wax in the pens won't pick up the special gems. Let's take a look at what we've got here. Okay. So we've got eight sort of rhinestones so we've got like a sort of an orangey goldish color the silver yellow which is like a light blue a light pink we've got just some plain 310 pretty pretty purple a nice red then we've got some of these teeny tiny little teardrop shapes, which are silver. And more of the teeny tiny teardrops, which are like a, a bright pink color. We've got some, I think these are called marquee shape. So a nice, where is my camera out there? A nice blue. And we've got some slightly bigger than normal rhinestones in like that orangey yellowish color again. These ones are interesting. So the silver side for these is actually the flat side and the gold side is what shows. But both are really nice. We've got some blue circles. We've got one big red gem, um, which I'm guessing goes here, and we better not lose that one. And we've got some gold stars, so that's quite pretty. 
I think that'll look really nice when it's done. Um, let me just find... I've made up little bags with labels to put the drills in. Actually, I'll just double check we've got them all. There's one through eight, nine, ten, uh, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Yep, they're all there. I just sometimes the special drills they don't send them all and it's so hard to get replacements for them so I just like to check okay now this is supposed to be a 30 by 40 I'm gonna guess that that is from this black line to the edge so the actual painting itself is 24 let me just write this down 24 by 24 I need to get one of those tape measures 24 by 34 is the actual painting size okay so that is that one got quite a few in this order but um, it shouldn't take too long to go through them because they're just special gems. Okay this next one is the special pony. I've seen these on AliExpress um, and they come with frames but they're up around like $20 or something. Um, this one cost me $4.91. It's a 15 by 20 um, I've got it down as a full because it's pretty much a full, um, but it is special gems. So let's take a look here. So we've got our, our basic toolkit here. I'm not sure what that is. Some sort of sticker, maybe. It's like some sort of double-sided pad thing. I'm not sure what that's for. Here is our canvas. So it is a 15 by 20, so it's very accurate. I think this is really, really cute. It's so cute. There were so many different designs. Okay, that's odd. There's, ah, there's an extra lot of plastic there. I thought it wasn't sticky, but there's an extra slice of plastic under the top there. But no, it's definitely sticky. Okay, let's take a look at our drills. They're all joined together. Now, that's one thing I've noticed is there is no um, inventory with it. So, no way of knowing other than the label on your drills as to what goes on here. So, let me see. Yeah, K is the big circles, T and O are the blue, so yeah, so there's no inventory sheet, so you don't want to lose this packaging, and when you kit it up, you'll want to copy the code off of here, that's, yeah, okay, so we've got some silver rhinestones, and then they get slightly bigger, 
and then bigger again. Pink rhinestones, and again, slightly bigger. And then we've got a sort of darker pink, and again, slightly bigger. Yellow in the small and the big. We've got a blue in the small and in the big. We've got just plain white in small and then in a bigger size and plain black in the small and a bigger size. So I'm going to assume everything is there because there's no inventory sheet to compare it to. That does not look good at all. Hmm. Looks like it's just been wedged into the bag. Hopefully it's not too bad. Okay. So this looks like the special butterfly. Let me just get my sheet. So it should be this picture. Uh, this is supposed to be a 40 by 40 partial gem and it cost me $12.80. So let's see if this canvas is okay. Quite a lot of creasing in the back, but the beauty of it having a clear cover is that it shouldn't have affected the glue at all. Seems okay. It's a fairly soft canvas too. Feels more like fabric than anything so I think having it lay flat under things will sort it out. Um, should be okay. So I'll make sure this one goes on the very bottom of everything um, just to flatten it out properly and yeah, should be alright. Okay, so uh, standard toolkit, we've got some baggies, the pen, the wax, the tray and our drills, it says there are 13 gems in this one. So let's take a look here. Okay. So we've got number 13 of these pretty purple ones. Number 12 are these pink, pinkish, reddish ones. Uh, 11, we have the sort of clear holographic type gems. 10 looks like some of the sort of dark blue AB. Oh no, wait, that's number one, sorry. <laughs> 10 is these green. And nine, we've got some pink teardrops. Eight is, 
some really pretty blue teardrops. Seven of these itty bitty teardrops. These are so much fun to put down. And yes, I am being sarcastic. Uh, six is these small teardrops again, but in red. Five small teardrops in purple. Four are these round purple ones. Three the round ones in an orange. And two are the round ones in a green. And then we already had number one. So I think this will be really pretty. Um, now it says it's 40 by 40. Which Yep, that's the painting size, so that's pretty good. It's nice and accurate. Um, yeah, I will lay this underneath everything else in my box of paintings, and it should flatten out okay, thankfully. That was a bit scary there. I thought it would be um, something I'd have to do a lot of fixing up to. And I don't own an iron. I, I don't know how to iron things. So <laughs> that would be fun. I don't even know if my mum owns an iron. Okay, so that is that one. How are we going for time? I might have to split this into two videos. How many more have I got left? Alright, I'll do a couple more and then I think we'll split it. Uh, so this one, let's take a look. Aha, uh -huh. okay. So this one should be the special bear. It's very cute and colourful. This was described as a 37 by 27 centimeter partial special gem and it cost me $7.27. Now looking at this, I'm pretty sure the 37 by 27 is going to be canvas size because he looks very small. by 20 is the actual size okay so he's very cute very colorful uh, we've got another standard toolkit and some So we've got seven colours all up. So here are our rhinestones and there's a few stowaways in there. There's some AB gems hiding in them. So we've got some silver, some red, yellow, blue, green and purple. And then we've got some cute little silver stars that go around him. So that one will be really cute and quite sparkly, I think, being mainly rhinestones. Okay, so we're at 20 minutes and I've got five left to do. So I might call this one here 
and I'll do a part two with the other five um, just so that the videos aren't too long. So please, if you've got any questions or comments, leave them down below. Feel free to give a like or a dislike. Subscribe if you haven't already and I will see you in the next video. Take care. Bye-bye.